white history is too all-encompassing because like we built a lot of stuff I don't know companies leverage it to either make their businesses look good or make themselves look good would you say it's, it's genuine no that's not genuine Morgan Freeman said the term African-American is an insult it is an insult we're the Native Americans here that makes sense I guess you're making my brain work I get it. You're trying to celebrate, you know, the history of everything that's happened. It also happened so long ago. Like Chinese, they used to be slaves yeah. for Mexicans too. Like, oh, for real? Yeah, they they don't really talk about that, you know. Why? Like, it's, why don't we uh, talk about that? I didn't even know about that. <laughs> Instead of being called African American, what would you prefer? Native American, because we are the natives here. Don't you think the Native Americans would find that offensive? Because the Native the Native Americans are our brothers as well. So you think you're the Native American? I know that I'm the Native American. How about the Indians, the Native Indians, the ones who Columbus and the likes met on this land? Do you regard them as Natives too, or you're more Native than them? We're more Native than them. Interesting. Is Black History Month needed? What's its purpose, dude? There's a stark reminder, fresh off of January, about how much slavery happened yeah. and civil rights happened. That doesn't seem necessary. There were positive, good white people that helped, yeah. but I love the Underground Railroad and I love those stories. Those are the ones that I love about Black History Month, in my opinion. Because in high school, all they teach us about is white history. Maybe like one week they'll spend on on like slavery and black history. But Outside of Black History Month, I'm still thinking about black people. Like I don't know, I haven't thought about it like that. Should every race have a history month. Like if I was like Indian History Month is November, I'd be like Thanksgiving and curry, I don't know. There were a lot of Europeans as well, like Italian. They mm -hmm. went through a lot of things. So yeah. why don't they get a separate month? We celebrate Columbus Day. Yeah. In my, in my opinion, that's bullshit because it was <laughs> nothing but white Americans killing and slaughtering Indians. So the day is not to celebrate the white man. The day is to celebrate actually, or it, it's not a celebration, essentially. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry. Do you believe that black history is American history? Uh, I mean, it's part of American history. I don't agree with that. What bad thing has happened in your life where you go, you know what, let me think about that for a good 30 day stint. That'll, that'll make things better. The, a constant reminder of like injustices, like I think it makes white people feel awkward. Cause- So you think white guilt is a, is a real thing? The only reason why it would exist would be from white guilt. Uh, no, I actually like get a little annoyed that like, like race is such a big thing and that it's like, it's just dividing people, I personally yeah. think. Yeah, I you do have think. a point. But if we say, oh, hey, we're not gonna talk about black, white, how can we fight inequalities wherever they might be? Doing stuff like this. Well, what are your thoughts on Thanksgiving then? It was how the Indians, you know, welcomed the, yeah. Yeah, the Europeans, but they killed all of them. Americanized version of Thanksgiving. I have a beautiful, loving family, mm. but the actual like premise of Thanksgiving is fucked up. Like all the movies about hey, trials and tribulations, who the fuck wants to see that shit? You don't think slavery movies are needed? For what, dude? Like, I'm just like- Awareness. Awa we, everyone knows slavery happens. It's crazy how uh, like transgender women, they're women now, just women. But black people are still black people. I think it's kind of fucked up that they picked the shortest month for Black History Month. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> Gay Pride Month is like 31 days. They prioritize Gay Pride over Black History Month. They do, they do. Who's they though? That's a good question. Who's they? Now you're asking the right question. Like they're trying to remove slavery from textbooks. So why would you want to do that? That's an important, that's history. History is told from the perspective of the people that are currently in power. And I think that it should be told and taught from a person of color. So never who's from, connected. So yeah. never from a white person? Uh, there's statistics that show that students excel whatever their race, right? Yeah. When they are led by an African-American male teacher. I, why are black people always shooting each other? I get kind of a crabs in a barrel mentality. It's confrontational. We have to battle it out. That's yeah. the way it feels. Hey. There's only one spot for us. Who the fuck is gonna get it? We're gonna have to battle it out. I don't think they should do away with it. Um, Dark history is still history. We're native from here, and they've gotten us to believe that we're from somewhere else. We're gifted in music. White people have, are better at, at rap than us right now. Uh, sexy red. These so, are not good looks. So you're not proud of what we're doing in the music industry? Of course not, dude. Okay, I'm asking you as a young black woman, who's profiting from Black History Month? I don't think black people are. I say a lot of marketing for marketing. black history, yes. So it's just business idea, yeah. like Valentine's Day, yeah. like, <laughs> uh, like Christmas. If there was no month, 
that was telling them, quote unquote, about their ancestors, what they went through. Do you think people would still know? It's it's some, but it, it doesn't really explain into depth about stuff like that. You know, like so this just, month explains into depth. Yes, it like it gives it gives what it really was, what like you guys like different people went through and stuff like that. If there isn't that space of time for awareness, they kind of. People just kind of brush it off. But what is the awareness? What are you made aware of right now? Um, I wanted to say how far we've come. Some people have said it before, uh -huh. you know, that Judge Floyd, the day he died, should be a public holiday. Yeah, well, I definitely think that, I mean, there should be like maybe like one day to celebrate all of that. I think it highlights something else. What we were taught in history books, which I feel like a lot of stuff does get left out. In history books, I feel like we're taught, well, you know, a lot of people were, against slavery, but I don't think that that's necessarily true. I think that that's just kind of what they're trying to push onto us. I think they're trying to teach us a different sort of narrative. I think that Black History Month is kind of like a sorry little try to make up for the lack of acknowledgement or a lack of accountability from what they're leaving out of the history books, if that makes sense. All right, my friends, you've heard it. If you like this video, subscribe, like, share, and I'll see you next time.